<laughs> it's crazy. When he saw it on the screen, he was like, wait, that's now. How's that work? Yeah. Because, I mean, how does It's that also work? really funny that the, uh, I was, I was actually just about to gesture with the knife towards the screen. And I was like, <laughs> like, and I was like commenting <laughs> on the weirdness of that. <laughs> um, yeah. This is right after I just turned off the camera in the last vlog, and I'm actually editing the shit now. And my grandmother gave me that. Her grandmother. Her grandmother. My, his, her, <laughs> her grandmother. Her grandmother. Her gave grandmother me that. gave it to him. His, my, his, my. It's Harrison's wife <laughs> that we talked about once. He's got a kid. So I need to finish editing. I need to take a shower, I need to wake up, I need to go on the train, I need to get in a car with a stranger, which you should never do, kids, but I'm doing it for a measly $100 or whatever the hell he's going to pay me, and I'm going to drive to Westchester, New York. Has anyone ever been there? Has anyone ever been to Westchester, New York? Isn't that where Don Draper lived or something? If he didn't no, live there, he lived somewhere they, exactly like it. So. He, yeah, he lived like closer to there. I think they moved to Rye later. Wait, like, when, well, uh... <laughs> Oh, you're not gonna see it again, but I can't do it for them. What? It might be a spo spoiler alert. Spoiler alert! alert. It fucking happened. Fuck you guys. Um, <laughs> I'm not, no, I'm not gonna say it. Say it! Oh, well. You spoiler alerted it. It's, it's like ample time. Turn it off now. Okay, yeah. Spoiler alert. Spoiler, <laughs> spoiler alert. Um, when, uh, when they get divorced, um, she moves to Rye with, like, with her new boyfriend. Okay, cool, man. Yeah. What was that? End of spoiler. What, what movie was that? Uh, Mad Men. Ugh. Good morning, guys. I haven't slept at all. I laid in bed for five... Actually, no, six hours. I just sat there and I just couldn't sleep. I just, I don't know. It's not that I'm nervous. Because this is actually probably going to be pretty easy, but... I don't know. I don't know why it is I can't sleep, besides the fact that I want to fucking nocturnal sleep schedule now. It's not to the point where I eat donuts on the subway while I'm walking. I'm serious now. The building's moving super cool. It's like a Zerg building. Super weird field, super weird statues. Super weird hour in the morning, everything's half-mast. Don't know where I'm going, know what I'm doing. Super confused, super scared. So apparently we're driving up in the middle of the state. Well, not the middle of the state, up in White Plains to go take pictures of luxury jets, interior shots and video. So this is gonna be nuts and I haven't slept, I'm crazy. And we're using Carl Zeiss lenses. <laughs> Currently buying flowers to put in the plane make it look more executive. <laughs> it's funny. I drive up to a private jet on a runway, get out of a car, while wearing a leather jacket. <laughs> Cross that off my to-do list. <laughs> Some serious art shit going on. The floor is weird. You kids up on your hangar safety? Breaking the law. Probably breaking the law. Definitely not watching my step. The thing that sucks about these jets is the head clearance. Look at this. Too low. Piece of shit. Oh my god, it's got a camera. Oh, it's got a little backup camera. How cool is that? Oh my god. How cool. It's got some more shit under here. It's got some shit that'll cut your head off. That's cool. It's kind of weird going up very close to the stuff that you typically you kind of can't get near. It shined up though. God. So here's what it's like to be rich and famous. Enjoy it. Going up in my plane. Do, do, do. Fall down the steps. Ah. Not bad. Ah. Whatever. I mean, it's fruit, but fuck it. Whatever, dude. <laughs> this is what it's like to be in your very own private jet. I'll be here someday. It's gonna be time. <laughs> Fold out table. That's a bed right there. That's a bed, and that's a TV, and that's a window. It's a hanger. Fuck. There's uh, rich people wine things and brandy things, and there's a bathroom, kitchenette, on a fucking plane, etc. On a fucking plane, etc. And this is my job: is to look at it, covet, and never have. Did I break that? Shit. Here, take a look at the cockpit. You know why they call it the cockpit, right? Cool. God, this is fucking nice. I will kill any one of you. Any one of you within the sound of my voice to have this. <laughs> Look.
Look at they have snacks in the toilet. We bought a bunch of fruit, stupid fruit shit to arrange. Of course, we're not gonna eat it because you know, fuck that. But we're gonna put on some nice looking silverware, then we're gonna put it on that table, and then rich people, you know, they love fruit. Put fruit in their pictures, they will buy anything. Fucking anything. Ooh, that's a refrigerator. Cool, dude. Everything's like super locked and so doesn't move around because this thing flies. Ooh, gum. Shit, somebody's been eating it. I want to eat some of it. Fuck. I hope it's not like something else, like drugs. I hope it's actually gum. Doesn't that look good, dude? I'm now flower arrangement boy. Did I do good? Is it pretty? Am I stripped of all masculinity yet? You guys seen the richest people I'm ever gonna see in my entire life today? Fucking plane on the tarmac. How cool are we? How cool are we? <laughs> Big jib. Oh god. I wanna go home. I'm tired. I've been up for like 48 hours. Are we moving? I think we're moving. I just, I just realized we're moving. Bet your sweet ass they bought me pizza. Ha <laughs> ha! Tough life, man. I got to touch this thing. Dink! Dink! Bye, baby. Ah, you're cold. Day is over. I'm so fucking tired. Ew. Been gone for too long. Gotta go get more pizza. Just had pizza. Gotta go get more pizza. Look at Woo! something you'll never have again. A picture of something you'll never even touch.